Hello. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> Welcome everyone back to another episode of Sunday Sipping, where we begin and end every week with a conversation and a couple of drinks. My name is Trey. I'm Ling. Welcome to Sunday Sipping. Yeah. <laughs> Cat has uh, redeemed a finger heart. Hi, Cat. For you and mwah, for you. Hi, okay. everybody. We actually had the mic working this time. Yeah. Sorry if we seem a little out, out of it. Um, we both woke up from a very much needed nap. Yeah, and we like, didn't realize that we needed a nap, and we're like, you know, like 40 minutes late, but that's okay. You should say that better be in that Hagio shirt. Uh, it just looks like it is, but it is not. It's more of like a like a black girl magic shirt. Yeah. Here, I'll move Cock Josh yeah. out the way. Move the way, Cock Josh. Check it out. Look at her, she's fabulous. Yeah. You got awesome. something against Black Girl Magic Fisty, huh? Hmm? Hmm? On Juneteenth. Oh, wait, it's like August. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, welcome on, uh, welcome on in, guys. Um, today is actually a, uh, a little different episode. Um, it's one of the more normal episodes of Sunday Sipping. We're doing the <laughs> open bar night. Um, we're going to try to do this every single month, at least once mm -hmm. a week, or once a month, um, where no theme or anything we just make drinks that you guys request using points and stuff like that yeah but yeah. you honestly don't have to just use points if y'all are feeling anything yeah. or if you want to see something made or we'll talk about what we've been wanting to make that we haven't made we're just we're just gonna vibe and make drinks together so sure oh band damn <laughs> <laughs> but yeah um we uh, wait what is everyone sipping on first of all yes um we are about to be sipping on some cocktails and also, how's everyone's week? How was your last week, babe? I love this song. I can tell. <laughs> um, oh, I, I said add bacon. The, <laughs> <laughs> we have to do another BLT episode. I we feel like do. That would be fun. Um, I feel like my last week has been very chaotic. It's been a lot. Oh, gosh. Hey, yo, Bella, what's, what's up? up Bella? Hey, how's everybody. It Welcome on in, Raiders. How's it going, what's on, Raiders? What's up? I saw you guys were watching cartoons, right? What were we watching? Like, yeah, what were you guys watching? Oh my gosh. Uh, Hello, everyone. Wildflower, if we can get a shout out for Bad Bella Games here, our wonderful friend. Um, she is an absolutely wonderful person, so if you guys have not checked her out, she does a lot of different variety streams. Uh, she plays some Valorant, uh, hangs out with everybody, watches cartoons. So if you have not given her some love, please go and do that. Please do. And again, um, so for those of you who are new to uh, the channel right now, we I need Andy no already. ice. Make it a drunk. Make it extra drunk. <laughs> Coming up. Any extra, no ice, extra drunk. That's a drink of my people right there. There we go. The drink of my people. <laughs> All right, Fisty said pronoun check. Um, for those of you in the co uh, comments, feel free to tell us what your uh, what you like to go by and also the pronoun um, that you uh, go by. Uh, I am Trey. I go by he they. I'm Ling. Uh, my pronouns are she, her. And everybody who is new, welcome to the BLT bar. The BLT in this bar does not stand for bacon, lettuce, tomato, contrary to, you know, popular belief. But uh, we are a variety streamer. Every Sunday we do a, a food drink stream. We just make drinks and hang out here at the bar. We also play games uh, every now and then, and I'm very chaotic when I do. But yeah, welcome on in. Welcome. So good to have you guys. All right. Thanks for all the follows, Thank everybody. You guys so much. I can't read everybody right now, but uh, everybody who's followed, I see Jesus Juice, Yudo, you and Yudo. Yudo. Uh, we have Jesus Juice. We have uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. Uh, but yes, anyway, my week has been. I think it's been kind of a. It feels like a lot has happened. It feels like I've I've like been through a whole entire month, but it's been like a week. It. It's been a rough one, but hey, I made it to the end of the week, so. <laughs> I'm, I, How about you? Felt, I was just working a lot. I felt really busy. Um, nothing bad or anything. It was just it was just a very busy week. Um, nothing too. Nothing you did too a rough. yeah. You had, you did a lot. Your schedule was very full. So. Yeah, we're gonna be out of town this weekend, um, so I was working a lot this weekend kind of, to kind of make up for that. Oh, that makes sense. All right, so, um, what are we making? Um, okay, so somebody already asked for a henny, so there's that. We can spend long. I'm ready to throw hands. Yeah, I know, Kat, you are ready to throw hands, so. Oh, wait, we just got an order. Hold on. Who said that? Ordering a drink extra strong is the best way to get a weak pour. Yeah. 
Exciting. Where are you going? We don't know. You do, though. <laughs> We're going on our uh, bachelor slash bachelorette uh, trip, and our friends, uh, some of you guys are in the chat, uh, have decided to take us somewhere. We have no idea where we're going. <laughs> I usually so we, usually we're the ones to like organize trips. And stuff yes, like that. we're the planners. <laughs> and this is the first time we haven't. And I can't lie when I say like I'm nervous. Like yeah. I, I don't know. Boot, I'm gonna get, like a plastic bag over my head. And just, like, <laughs> drag in <laughs> Come with us. <laughs> um. Week was meh. It was a mental spiral for majority of life. Oh, I'm sorry, oh, dragon. Sorry to hear that, dragon. I definitely know how that feels because it's kind of how I was. But hopefully this is the start of a new week. Mm -hmm. This is the end of last week. And we can start off with just a little bit of hanging out. Sure. And even if this is going to be the highlight of your week, I hope it's a good little bit that you can hold on to or it will just get better. That's what Sunday Sippin's for. Ooh. Oh, we are going to redacted. <laughs> um, let's go ahead and uh, take care of... Um, Somebody asked for a drink. Uh, where was that one? Get their name Sunday right. Sunday morning cartoon. Uh, Yudo. Friends. I love that. Yudo wants a shot of Henny, no ice, extra drunk. So to start well, off, we'll start it off that way. Yeah. We'll take a little sippy sip. While you pour that, let me introduce the B in the BOP. Oh, and also we got something. Oh wait, we already introduced that last week. Yes. Yes. Everybody what? say hi to the B in the BLT bar. This is Brew. Oh, yeah, BLT bar doesn't stand for bacon, lettuce, tomato. It's, it's brew. It's right there. Stand it's in order. brew. Yeah. Ling. That's Ling right here. All right, now we're in order. And Trey. That's me. <laughs> Why <are> you both? <laughs> <laughs> oh, here's the brew some pets. This is from Cat. Say hello, brew. Can say hi. He's been Brungy grumbly boy. all day. I think he's just. So he usually is like a crazy ass dog that like screams a lot. But I think with him getting older and stuff, he's definitely mellowing out. And he's just like... He's just becoming grouchy. He just bumbles a lot. <laughs> yeah, he's a bumbly. Oh, give Brew a tree toe, too. Okay, hold on. Brewcon, Lingtus, and Tremato. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of like that. <laughs> That's our Sunday sipping, uh, like, superhero names or something. <laughs> our sun, right, our sipping hero, no, Sunday... I'm trying to make a little pun. Sun... Sip, sipper hero, not a superhero. We're a sipper hero. A sipper hero. hero. Sipper are his hero. Uh, are his treats over there? Oh, they're right there behind you. Right in there. Oh, I was like, dang, I couldn't see it. <laughs> okay, this is for Yudo. A little bit of Henny. A little bit of Henny. These are the. This is literally like the drink of, like both of our cultures. Yes. It is this is the pe the the drink of our peoples? Yeah. Loud people, oh, like black people, we love our some. Uh, we love us some. Hennessy. We love Henny, bro. Oh, and here's Brew eating a treat. Are you ready? Spin. Ah, spin. Good boy. Good boy. Look oh, God. Good. Okay, he. Thank you for using your drinks. He definitely enjoyed. He wasn't feeling these last week, and now he is. So. Again, he's bumbly, dude. He... A little bumbly. <clears throat> That's okay. That's okay. Oh, hi, Leopard. I didn't see Leopard here. Yes, Leopard was here. The Leopard actually gave Brew the treat. Okay. All right. I don't know which one you want, but... Oh, I'll take this one. Okay. We need a toast for Sunny Sippin'. Yeah, we do. We can do... So, my go-to toast is the fighting, stealing, yeah. drinking. So, we, we'll use that one. Oh, yeah, we'll use that one. So... To sip in safely. To sip in safely. Okay. We'll take that. Or, unless you want to do the fighting, stealing, drinking. To sip in safely. To sip in safely. Hell yeah. Okay. So, Ooh. again, it is open bar night. So what we're going to be doing, we just take requests. We're just making drinks. If we have the stuff available in the bar to make it, then we'll make it. If we mm -hmm. don't, we'll improvise. Yes. <laughs> Uh, also, no worries, Dragon. Hopefully, your D and D map goes well. Feel free to share as you. It's the one that you've been working on, right? Mm -hmm. Feel free to share in the Discord. Which, by the Do way, we have a D and D uh, Discord. We channel? have just a. We have a showcase one, but we don't have a D and D one. Let's so do D and D. We'll, I mean, we'll make that. Yeah. <laughs> shot! 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 <laughs> Leopard knows what's up. Okay. Okay. So, what are we wanting first, guys? Um, I'm gonna give it about 20 seconds. And I. I'll, I'll give a couple suggestions that I've been thinking of. Okay. So, 
We have, we, he actually made yesterday a couple of Palomas, which is a grapefruit based to, and grapefruit and tequila based drink, um, which is super refreshing. So that's super tasty. Look how like rotund. He's so rotund. Josh, like, Josh is. Josh is over there. That's our mascot, by the way. That's Josh the this chicken. This is Josh. Thank you so much to Cat, who's in the chat, who actually... Oh, that rhymed. Yo, um, the bars. Cat in the chat that got us that chicken. Oh! <laughs> Yo, thank you so much to Cat in the chat with... What'd you say again? Getting us who that? Who gave us that, that chicken. Chicken. Yeah. <laughs> it's not I like pizza, so that's all that matters. I like the sweet can't taste alcohol. But I will get you fucked up. But we'll get you fucked up if you have three drinks. <laughs> okay, so she likes the, the sneaky, sneaky, little snake. So something, something sweet. Something sweet. What can be made that's sweet? Okay. Yeah. It was too cute not to get. Yes, we appreciate you. You'll have to, you'll have to like feel him in person because he. He's he is... very soft. Oh, so again, just so you guys know. That is Chicken Josh. That's our mascot. But, um, so, there is a multiverse theory out there. So, uh, yes, there's a BLT of our multiverse. There's different, you know, forms of Trey out there from different universes. There's different forms of Josh and Ling and Brew out there. And uh, there was, like, a little, some, like, you know, the time warp continuum place, you know, got fucked up one day. And somehow, uh, we got another form of Josh over here in the top right-hand corner. Uh, his name is Cock Josh. He, he's he's a dick. He's, yep. he's very mean. Um, but, you know, he's he's also another form of Josh, so we had to have him on the show. Um, and then the emotes that you guys actually just used is the wonderful, cute little Chick Josh. Chick Josh. Chick Josh is a uh, baby. We he, we protect him. Am I a different form of Trey? You could be. You could be. We don't we know. Don't know. <laughs> mm -mm. <laughs> but, yeah. Oh, yes, names of drinks. That's what Leopard was saying. So, a Paloma. Actually, I'll type it in the... Uh, so, Paloma. we have a Paloma, which is a very uh, bright and refreshing uh, grapefruit cocktail. So, it's very fizzy. Um, we can make... Hey, is, I mean, I am Trey. Yeah, oh, that's right. You guys share the same name. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, the it... relationship to Cognac actually dates back to World War One and World War Two era. Um, cognac industry in the U.S. got a huge boost from hip-hop in early 2002. That's pretty dope. Okay. So, oh. I hope, I hope he's being legit. Are you being legit? No, that, that, I, I don't think he would make that up. I don't know. I can never tell sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> um. Gin, Fizz, is it Gin, Fizz, Ramos? Gin, Ramos? Gin, I think it's Gin, Fizz, Ramos. Check, uh, consult the book. I would just put Gin Fizz if you can just do that. Oops, just kidding. I just put that. So this is a really cool looking drink because the way that you make it is you, it's in a highball glass, which is like a tall vertical glass. This is a highball and, glass right here. Yes. So you make it in this and at the very end you'll pour in, I think like club soda or some kind of sparkling like fizzy water. And there's a foam that will actually like float up at the top and it, it'll be like cylindrical up at the top which is super cool i've never made it before so that's an option there uh we can make a classic margarita margarita whiskey drinks are also a thing so old fashions um manhattan and we, we, what's one more thing oh uh let's do a straight up martini okay those are the, the uh those martini. are the options Consulting my cocktail book to make an informer was. <laughs> yes, Lino Roo. Also, hello. I don't know if we said hello, but. My cocktail coll book collection is getting pretty big. It is. Actually, Lino Roo got you one of these, didn't you? Yes. She? Uh, yeah, this one. This one. Was it this one? I think so. I love this one. It's really cute. It's a, it's a Dungeon Master's uh, like D&D &D cocktail book. I think it's so cool. All right, we have... Gin Fizz, Ramos, or a martini. We've got okay. two for a martini. Uh, ties go back to black soldiers on French fronts in the war and then culturally stayed with the black community. In the States, a more recent boom was from the drink of hip hop moved to Crystal Head Tennis. Cool. Oh. Should have put a little educational tag in there. You learn a little, you learn a little <laughs> something every day. Um, I told Trey that the Paloma gave me a sitting on the beach, but I'm terrified of the ocean, so I'm sipping this drink and feeling the sun vibes. 
Yeah, okay. I could see Sebastian just like with her toes out on the sand with her little uh, her little mm-hmm. paloma. <laughs> um, a whiskey drink, then a vodka drink, then a lager, and then a cider drink. Ooh, oh, that's one thing that this bar does not have beer. Yes, we we should we should probably keep some. I think um, in case uh, Ramkip is listening, our wonderful friend Ramkip, who who we have featured a couple times actually, is the beer tender in our group. So that's a cool name, beer tender. Uh, yes. If, uh... Blah, blah, blah. Brew just came in this... here at Mach 5 just now. <laughs> oh, he has his little sushi. Uh, Wildflower, if you can give a shout-out to Ramkip. Uh, he does... He doesn't usually stream... He doesn't have a, a steady stream schedule, but anytime you all have any beer questions, feel free to ask him as well. Oh, that's a reference to something, Dragon said. I, I have no idea. A whiskey drink, then a vodka drink, then a lager drink, and then a cider drink? I, I have no idea. I don't know what the reference is, actually. I think forms. I think the vote right now is martini. Yes, so I see let's martini. A, let's do a martini. Okay, dirty martini. Thumb thumping. I don't know what that is, actually. We're doing a dirty martini? That's what, I see one for dirty martini and one for regular martini. Okay. Um, do we have different colors of sanding sugar? We do not, unfortunately. We have, we have sugar in the raw. <laughs> Wait, where's the... It's where, a ch- Chumba Wumba. Where are the olives? They should be in there. I feel like I just used it. <laughs> He's looking for olives. <laughs> I love that song. Okay, somebody knows what you're talking about, Dragon. I'm sorry. <laughs> Did we eat all the olives? I don't think so. Here, let me look. Let me check downstairs really quick. Hold on, let me, wait, let me look. Because I know... Senses, y'all. Check it out. Here, Cock Josh, take him. Jo- uh, Cock Josh has been kind of quiet tonight. What are you, blind? Oh, them god. olives have always been there. Oh, god. I saw you put them in there last week. Oh, god. You dipshit. Oh, god. That's okay. Okay, Cock Josh. <laughs> chill, chill, chill. You got four eyes, none of them work. <laughs> Yeah, jo- a cog Josh is uh, something else. <laughs> but we, we love him. He, again, he is Josh from another universe, so we, you know, we, we, ex- we, we have to by default accept him. <laughs> All right, okay. so, how we make a martini? I um, said, how we make martini? How we make martini. How we make martini. Okay, so do you want to make this or do you want me to make this? I have not made a martini, actually, so let me make a martini. Okay, I got you. Here you go. Wait, we always, uh, where's the mixing glass? Right here. Oh, yeah, we got, so we got a brand new mixing glass. And by a brand new, I mean four brand new mixing glasses. It was like 30 bucks, so. Like, it was like, no, it was like 23 bucks for four, oh, four of them, so that's dope. pretty nice. Dirty Mar- do you want to make a gin one, or do you want to make a uh, vodka one? Vodka? Let's do vodka. Vodka? Okay, for a dirty martini, you are going Sorry. to need... What is, what is Brew doing? He's sniffing this bottle really intensely, just like... But you can't have alcohol. <laughs> uh... <laughs> We're just uncultured. It's okay. <laughs> Let's do... Okay, it's going to be one, and a half, or one half ounce... I don't know where the pickers went. Are we right over pickers? here. Nope, right here. Oh, okay. So we're doing a vodka one then, right? Yep. Okay. Dirty martini is very, very easy to make. Yes. Where is the... The... Oh. There it is. Okay. What you need? One half ounce of uh, dry vermouth. Let me grab that oh, for you. I need that. Plus... One and a half ounces? One half. Oh, a half ounce. A half ounce. Okay, yeah. Don't say that. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then three ounces of gin or vodka. Three? Yes. Uno. Song. Dos. Sam. Sam. Okay. Okay. He'd be like drunk like Charlie all the dogs go to heaven. Oh my god. Have you seen all dogs go to heaven? It's been a long time, but I have. Put that in the fridge. Thank you. 
Okay. All right. Okay. Oh no, it just chipped. Just chipped. Or it looks like it warped. It probably was just always like that. We just never noticed. Hmm. Okay. And then ice. Just to cool it. Yep. We gotta and start. Add some hand flavored ice. Do we have uh, lemons up here? Yeah, it's underneath the table right there. Limon. Limon. A limon. A rice chicken. Oh my god. A rice. <laughs> I guess it's appropriate as we do have chickens here. <laughs> a rice chicken. If you know what that's from, then. What is that me from? Me and you are some. We're some good ass friends. <laughs> a rice chicken. A rice. Are we gonna summon Miss Standard? A rice chicken. Ow. Also, hey King. I don't think we said hello. What's up? What are we sipping on today? So right now we are making a dirty martini. Tonight is an open bar night, so if you have any requests for drinks, let us know. Or if you're feeling a certain type of drink or like for a certain type of mood or whatever, let us know and we can see if we can make a drink. Okay, so we're just mixing these two, right? Mm -hmm. Do I need olive brine or anything? Oh yeah. Is that in oh kitchen? no! R.I.P. bro. R.I.P. Wait, I didn't even pick it up. I thought I did. <laughs> okay. And then... A half ounce of olive brine. Do I add it into this? Yeah. Man, this thing is... There we go. Ah, oh, this, this is so nostalgic. The song? Yes. This is, uh, City Folk. Oh, it's in, yeah, and then you're the, right. Mm -hmm, when you go to the city at night. I feel like you're the person that just knows every, like, video game soundtrack. That's so funny, because I literally was talking about that on stream yesterday. So, I was talking about how I don't have anything that's, Yo, I, uh... I lined this, uh, lemon up. Oh! <laughs> Fresh-ass Crispy! Right Yo, his lineup is crispy, look at that. Hey, it's, Boom. it's turtle but not! Okay, I'll have to call, I don't know if, uh, Super Saiyan is here either, because we also have somebody else who goes by Saiyan, so... Hello, turtle but not. Welcome on in. This is what I actually look like. <laughs> no VTuber <laughs> models today. <laughs> but welcome on into Sunday Sippin. We're right. we've got an open bar going on tonight, so uh, we're taking requests for drinks. I'm Ling. This is Trey. Hello. Okay. You should do something that tastes like a cookie. Uh, that might be good warm, like. Uh, like a hot, hot toddy, toddy but, but cookie. cookie. Okay, all right, we can go with that. Mm. Okay, so is that all I'm doing? Yep. You're pouring that. Like, oh, I see why you're pouring it so careful. Give that a little. I need a little skewer. A little for twist. Actually, I want this to be a little bit more. Huh? No, it's no, bro. All right, come on. He's kind of struggling. Yeah, I'm struggling with this. I got just water tonight. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with staying hydrated. We like hydro homies. Yes. Turtle but not to hydro homie. Uh, Osmosis Jones said, 10 second rule. If you pick up food off the ground before 10 seconds, you can eat. <laughs> 10 seconds is a long time. I saw. <laughs> That's no time to register that you dropped it. And you actually sit there for five seconds thinking the fact you oh, just I dropped, dropped it. This. Yeah. <laughs> You want to eat it off the floor. It's one of those things. <laughs> if it's 10 seconds. This is Pokemon. See, you just know. Uh, you just should, drop. I, should I dr just drop it? Yeah. Ooh. Dirty martini! All right, here's a dirty martini, y'all. Let me take a picture of it. Or, hey, you got it on your phone. Your phone's pretty here. You can grab my phone if you want. Okay. Yeah, have you, you, do you like dirty martinis? I do. I uh, grew into liking them, actually. They're a very hard drink to get into. Yes. You, you have to like, I mean, you have to like olives, for one. Yes, you do have to like olives. All right, are you guys on Team Olive or not Team Olive? Because that, there's, olives are polarizing. People usually, usually either really like them or they don't like them at all. I like olives. Me too. I've always liked olives. Hold up. Uh, Luna said big team olives. 
Uh, not uh, olives. Wildflower <laughs> wildflower says, olives. Her emote looks like an olive. <laughs> little sad face. Team olive. King likes olives. I do not like olives. It's just back and forth. Okay, well, right now we got, yeah. Oh, shit, we got, we got a... <laughs> okay, who's gonna break oh, this? Oh, yeah. You can keep you all your... <laughs> hey, what's up, Lyrics? Lyrics, hey, <laughs> how are you? Said you can keep all your olives. <laughs> all right, there's a tiebreaker there, is Lyrics. How's it been, friend? Hope you've been doing well. Oh, Here God, is, is our dirty fuck. martini. Watch out, cock Josh. Damn, you just yeeted him out. <laughs> He's a dick. You'll probably pay for that, just letting you know. I'm probably gonna get choked out in my sleep for doing that. Yeah. He might call it homies. <laughs> Something is sticky here, and I can't tell what it is. Is it this? Do that again, I'll break your legs. Oh. More for Team Olive. Oh, yeah, see, Turtle but not knows what's up. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry about that, Cock Josh. <laughs> All, All right. right, this is my very first one I've ever made, so let me know how it is. Oh, you want me to taste it first? Yeah. How'd I do? Solid. My only complaint isn't even your fault. I wish we chose gin. I like my uh, dirty martinis with gin instead of vodka. Oh, okay. This I think to me, the I think, huh? vodka brings out more Sweet. olive. It's a little oh, sweeter. It's a little sweeter. But if you had like top notch olive like olive quality then mm. i feel like vodka might be better for a dirty martini but gin has more intricacies about it vodka is usually just like smooth or whatever yeah and you're kind of uh like you said it's more intricate when you use gin because there's so many gin has different kinds of gins have so many different botanicals in it mm -hmm. that you know it's... one one bottle of gin that you put into the uh, dirty martini may vastly change the uh, change. Uh, Which I feel like is cool. Exhausted, but I'm hanging in there. How are y'all doing? Well, we're glad you're hanging in there. We're doing mm. well. Yes, we are doing well. We had an open bar night tonight, so if you have any requests for drinks, let us know. We'll see if we can get to them. Gin is um, good. I, I like gin as well, Leopard. It took me a while to get into gin, because I started off with, like, Tangeray or whatever, and it was not a fun time. Yeah. <laughs> um, When it comes to... You want to give them some tasting notes on this? Have you drank this yet? Yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I just did. So, oh, dang it. I keep trying to throw this lemon piece away, but it keeps, it keeps it coming back. back. There we go. All right. So, uh, when it comes to this dirty martini, if you've never had one, it it's a savory drink, so it's not sweet. Yes, dirty martini is um, it, it really accentuates the olive brine. Like, I feel like it's is very briny, which mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, we added olive brine to it, but. It tastes like. Um, like, if you had a little bit of seawater in your mouth, but it was like 30% seawater. Yes, that's, yeah, that's literally what it tastes like. And it's a little, it's a little like lemony and light from like the lemon garnish in there. Yep. Um, but aside from that, it, it's a, it's a very savory drink. It's very tasty though. Yeah. It's I not like for it's everyone. solid. No, it's not for everybody. Cat, you would not like this drink. Especially if you're not on Team Olive. <laughs> And yeah, I, I like my olive. I like my martinis with olives. <laughs> Me too. I can't remember the last time I had a regular martini. I only ever had. Oh no! The last time I had a regular martini was at our favorite pub in town, and our favorite bartender, which I have not seen in a little while, because I know he's in school. Um, but he literally made. Because I asked him, I was like, "Hey, I want a gin drink, but the what is like your gin drink of choice? Just, just make it." And he was like. Okay, I got you. So he made a regular classic martini uh, with gin, and that's probably been the best martini I've had. Oh, go, go. I'm gonna clean this glass real quick so we can make Maybe. another drink. Okay. Um, don't think I'd like that, but I'll try it one day. Okay, yeah, I feel like you would appreciate this drink, but I'm not sure if it'd be like a go to for you. A martini that comes to the taste of red velvet cake or cookie. Okay, we got two requests for a cookie drink, so we'll make one of those. There are actually, yes, there's absolutely three chickens on screen. And if somebody wants to go ahead and put some Josh, the surprise Josh emos, there will be multiple chickens on screen. <laughs> so our mascot is Josh the chicken. We don't really know how we got there, actually, but 
we we are the BLT bar and the, this chicken is our mascot, so. There are three chickens on screen. Yeah. <laughs> Turn up and not like, why are there so many chickens here? There's a lot of, you kind of, if you were in this room, you would see a lot of like knickknacks. There's a lot of stuff. It's like an like, I Spy book behind yeah, there's us. there's a lot of stuff in here. Like there's like, can anyone see the hidden T-Rex? Is it, is it, where is it? Damn, I don't even know where it is. Oh, oh, never mind. I see the Stegosaurus. Oh, for the person who um, finds a hidden T-Rex, we'll make a drink spe uh, specifically for them. Okay. Damn, I don't even know where the T-Rex is. Do you <laughs> see it? Yeah. It's kind of hard to see on screen, though. Um, where? I've been... It's been a bit since I've made myself a drink, even. I'm not sure if I have a request. Unless you have a blueberry balsamic shrub. No, nah, we do not have that, unfortunately. But we have blueberries, and we have balsamic vinegar. Leopard said the first shelf. Yes. Oh, okay, Leopard! Ding, ding, ding. Next to the black bottle. Oh, Leopard's got a good eye. Ba, 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 ba. I'm, I was, I'm in the bar and I didn't see it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna make a drink for Leopard. Okay, Leopard, what is your request? You don't, you don't even have to uh, like give me a drink. You can just tell me of something like, I don't know, something sweet or certain fruit. Uh, good one too. Uh, chocolatey, car caramelly, mm -hmm. like anything like that. They requested martini earlier and then the gin fizz Ramos, but in case you've got some more ideas, feel free to throw them out. Yeah. This is a very chill. The guitar is so good. Oh my god. I feel like I'm literally sitting at roost with my with my uh with my little coffee. I'm going to make... Do you have any whiskeys that would pair well with balsamic? Is the question. I don't know. I've never had balsamic in a drink before. So, I mean, you know, like... Like, some people let their vermouth go a little... A little uh, vinegary and use that sometimes. Mm -hmm. Um... I heard chocolate from... Uh, uh, something I think chocolate something but chocolate. strong, LOL. Y'all, <laughs> yeah. y'all trying to get us fucked up today. <laughs> I... My broken ass eyes squinting to find the tea, right? Girl, me too. I, I, I'm at the bar and I'm over here like, where? So we have this right here. Excuse me. Okay. This time I'm going to lightly move you, Cock Josh. Um, you better. Yeah, that's what I thought. I got bad lungs. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like he, he just broken. Like, he just, my knees hurt. My, my back but hurts. But he still my tries to, like, hurts. put up a front. <laughs> I have kidney stones. Leprosy. Mm. All right, we have Mozart dark chocolate liqueur. No, no, that's fine, Leopard. That's okay. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that. Hell, we have a bar, and we don't know how to make most drinks. We have a couple that we know how to make by heart, but... That took us a little while, because yeah. the old-fashioned, which I know how to make off the top of my head now, was an absolute disaster when I first made it on stream. So if you actually want to check out, we have all of our VODs saved on YouTube, or most of them saved on YouTube, if you look us up, the BLT bar. So you might be able to find where I fucked it up royally the first time. <laughs> it, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure how my feelings wanted to jump through the screen and like beat the shit out of me. <laughs> um, but yeah, we'll do something chocolate for you. The zombling would be good, but you can't drink it. Like a, like a chicken, a chocolate white Russian. That might be good. I feel like it's a little on the nose. What's well, something? You want something complicated? Not particularly complicated. What's something that will that will uh, use this to, that will highlight this? Um. I feel like. Okay, chocolate. So what notes? What notes would go well with chocolate? Or what, what liquor would go well with chocolate? What spirit? I think... I mean, I think... Vodka's kind of duh. Yeah, but... vodka's a duh. Maybe a weeded bourbon? You think a weeded bourbon would go well? Hmm. I swear I thought I, f I saw a Furby on one of those shelves. I think people are now <laughs> looking to see what's on like, thing. What the fuck is here? Uh, what would... Oh, the, the ears on this. 
these are ears that look kind of like a Furby. There's a few Animal Crossing characters up there, a few Pokemon characters, some Marvel, um, I got uh, some R BTS merch, a few Which plants. I don't think you can see RJ, but... <laughs> uh, a few skulls. It, yeah, it's kind of random. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot to look at, so if, if we ever get boring, you can look at the background. <laughs> okay, so I think... I mean, there's always a chocolate martini, but we just made it a martini, so I wanted something different. Okay. Yeah. Oh, chocolate martini is always good. Um, Leopard said, "Make your go-to drink with this." My go-to drink? Mm -hmm. Old Fashioned is my go-to, just because I know it off the top of my head. You know what? I'm gonna try to do a take on a Manhattan, but okay. chocolate. A chocolate Manhattan? Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna try this. <laughs> My summon word was said, Furby. <laughs> Hi, cat, welcome. <laughs> cause, cause people pair red wine with chocolate. So, because vermouth is just fortified oh, wait, red what's... wine. Actually, no, I'm not gonna use this. I'm gonna use chocolate uh, bitters. Hey, okay, all right, hold on. We yeah. have chocolate tamarind or Aztec chocolate, uh, which is... Let's do some chocolate tamarind. Showcase our friend's product. Larix over here has actually gifted us this, uh, the chocolate tamarind bitters. These are from almost a year ago now, actually. Hmm? Yeah, we like... use a lot. <laughs> well, dude, we, I love this. It's really good. Okay, um, so we got some chocolate bitters. Do you think I can do like a... Uh, Should you do it all? A whiskey sour? Ooh, that's a that would be a good one. You need an egg though, right? Or unless you want to do it without an egg. You want to do it without an egg or with egg? Mm, I would love to do it with an egg, but I don't feel like getting an egg. I can go with yours. Um, let me let me think of one more thing. Okay. <laughs> I'm in, I'm actually pretty enjoying this dirty martini. I didn't know I wanted one. I was like, I don't know if I'm gonna drink it, but I'm drinking it. So. Um. Ding ding ding. Ding ding ding. ding. Beep, beep, beep. Beep, beep, beep. I have a question. So, like a Sour Patch Kid, what? <laughs> Muddle some blueberries in simple syrup. Add lime, two bar spoons of balsamic, 1.5 gin, shake and strain. I mean, Ooh, that sounds good. Okay. Oh, wait, I want to. I wonder what. That. So, what does balsamic do to that? I'm guessing it makes it kind of tangy and. Is a little stringent in a way. Shrimp. Lyrics is the master of making, of crafting cocktails, let me tell you. <laughs> hmm. I think you should do a whiskey sour. But the thing is, when it comes to whiskey sour, I usually put uh, Angostura bitters on top of the foam. Okay. And it's more of like a... Oh, is it just decorative? It's not... It's more of a decorative thing. And okay. sometimes it does impart flavor, but Angostura and lemon kind of go together. I don't know if chocolate and lemon would really... Uh, do we have brandy? Yeah. Can you hand me the brandy? <sighs> I'm gonna... Uh, brandy and... It is technically Armagnac, but... Oh, I'll, I'll use it. And let's do a pretty robust bourbon. A robust? Yeah, let, let's, get, let's get Ghost Coast. This bourbon we actually got. Oh, sorry, my back is facing the camera. Um, <laughs> we actually got this on uh, our trip to Savannah with Wildflower. Yes. Balsamic is tangy, tart, uh, and it's like pepper. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay. And I need some simple syrup. That's right there. Can you grab that for me? Oh, I was like, where? <laughs> okay. Depends on the balsamic. Aged mm. ones tend to give a, a complex tartness and richness. I haven't tried any of the super fancy ones yet. Oh, we did. We were with Ramkip and Angel Lewis, actually. And our work location does have a location in Nashville. So we went to go visit. And there was, a, there was like, an olive oil shop that was in the same, like, building, I guess, as our Nashville location. Um, so we decided to stop in. And they did have some, like... St assorted balsamic flavors, which was super fun, and uh, they definitely water. tasted very different. You said water. 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 Okay. I'm gonna do... I have screen capped that layer, so if we don't get it to it on stream, I'm probably gonna make it sometime this week. I'm gonna grab that. So, I'm gonna do 
a Manhattan. We can officially buy the uh, chocolate tamarind really soon. Woo! I'm so excited. Me too. So, yeah. 1.7 or 1.75 ounces of bourbon. Okay. A little bit, uh, uh, maybe 0.5. You think I should do 0.75 or a full ounce of sweet vermouth? Do 0.75. 0.75 sweet vermouth. Okay. What do you need the brandy for? Um, I'm going to do... Uh, one second. I'm gonna add some brandy on top of this. Okay. I'm gonna do about 0.75 of this as well. Okay. So this will be a very spiritist cocktail. Spirit board. The leopard did say they wanted it. Uh, wanted it strong. Strong. So there's that and uh, chocolate tamarind bitters. I'm gonna do about. How much do we have left? Three okay. Three dashes maybe. <laughs> One, Turtle but not two. says I'm very curious. Yes, I'm also very curious too. We'll do that. Oh, oh yeah, Turtle, you weren't here for that. Okay, well, while we while, I stir this while we stir this, roll the intro. Thank you for using your drinks. Is this the old intro? No, the or new one. New one, okay. so good and i'm gonna grab a little bit one yeah bourbon cherry let's go i love that thank you my brother actually made it patty p productions um he's on instagram and I, he he sometimes shows up in stream but not often but uh yeah he was the one that made that intro for us we were actually looking to make a new one pretty soon too so we we've updated our looks a little bit so Keep that away from me. Yeah. Thank you. All right. Then. Oh, Brie, you're being so good. You're not being very right now. You're being so good. Yes, you are. You're such a good boy. Aren't you such a good boy? All right. He gets then three pets. Here's. Okay, what is that that you're adding to it? What, what do you mean? Oh, what did you just add to it? I just added one uh, bourbon cherry at the very bottom. Okay, so it is a bourbon cherry that he's added. Yeah. Wait, do I get one too? Yeah. It was just a little left over. Where's my cherry? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so sad. Cherry. Where's my cherry? <laughs> There's your little cherry. Do you guys like maraschino cherries? I know some people really love maraschino cherries. That's what they're saying. I think Wildflower's a big maraschino cherry fan. Okay. There was one time. <laughs> That's shaking. Me Sorry. There was one time that uh, so Old Smoky is a, a popular moonshine distillery here in Tennessee, and I think they're just a popular moonshine distillery in general. They have moonshine soaked cherries, and Wildflower got a jar one night. It was a couple years ago. We didn't realize how boozy they were because they tasted good. And they're just cherries, whatever, right? We ended up like you know, inhaling a couple cherries and we were like busted for a majority of the night. <laughs> so this is a chocolate Manhattan. Chocolate Manhattan. Okay, so let's take a picture next to, to the Rx's bitters. I'm gonna give it a little tasty taste real quick. Okay. Mm. Wow, this tastes like wow, cacao. Yeah, it's got it. It's giving me hit you in the size a little cacao. bit. Cacao. Mm -hmm. It's not a very sweet drink. Bruce is tea posing on the stairs. 
Bro. Seeing the darkness. What are you doing, man? Oh god. <laughs> His eyes gleam for a second. That was weird. Are you good, bro? Yeah, this is very cut. It's like This is tasty. This yeah, love it. It's not like chocolate chocolate. I mean, it is chocolate chocolate, but it's like cacao, like cacao. Yeah, nibs. it's like cacao. Yeah, cacao nibs. Literally like essence of chocolate. This is this is Good job, babe. Thanks. Oh, that's really good. I'm gonna do this and the where the bitters go. My only complaint about it, I wish I uh started it a little bit longer. Started it longer? You see, you want or it put it in a chilled coop. Yes, we always forget that we can chill glasses. There was somebody that I was uh I was with and I put a glass in the fridge and they were like and I asked them to get a to get the uh I asked them to get the glass out of the fridge. Mm-hmm. And they were like, wait, why Why did you put the glass in the fridge? Yeah, to chill it. And I was like, you you can chill glasses. And they looked at me and they were like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is tasty, actually. Thank you for the support, Leopard. Thank you for the suggestion. Luna is not Team Maraschino. <laughs> no, I would say I like bourbon cherries better than maraschino cherries. Maraschino cherries, I'm like, meh. Uh, Turtle asks, is the martini dirty or is it... Dur wait, is the martini dirty? Wait, is God, is a martini dirty or is a dirty martini? <laughs> <laughs> I got really confused. <laughs> you can read it. I still have a little bit of my dirty martini here. I think the dirty in a martini refers to the olive brine, correct? I'm guessing so. I don't really know why. I'm it's pretty dirty. sure. Every time when I was a kid and I heard dirty martini on like movies and shit, I was like, why the hell would they want that? Like, who's just putting dirt in their martini? Oh my god! <laughs> I thought I meant like a dirty glass. Like a dirty glass. <laughs> Oh, that's cute though. <laughs> it's like when I thought that, uh, like broccoli, as a kid, I thought broccoli was a uh, tiny tree. Tiny trees. And this is the one I'm kind of embarrassed about. When I was a kid, I thought that the stove light, like, you know, you had to turn Oh, the, uh, in, in the oven. Yeah, in the oven. I thought that browned your food. So I got. I was, my dad was cooking one day. <laughs> And I was, I think I was like seven. And I was like, no, you're not browning the food. The light's not on. He was like, what are you talking about? He, he was trying to figure out what I was talking about. And then finally I like climbed on the counter and like clicked it. And he was like, oh my God. No. Ah. All right. Uh, uh, I think you can get away with selling dirt and whiskeys. I know sometimes, uh, also, hello, welcome on in. Is it red, red crab? Red crab, blue crab. Red crab, blue crab. Blue crab, welcome on into the BLT bar. Sometimes, depending on where you, because I've seen it in our in the yeah our 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 whiskey bottles, you get to towards the bottom, you get a little bit of like sediment yeah and the char that's in there, and sometimes you get that in whiskeys. But yes, there are tequila worms. So speaking of tequila worm, do we have one? We do. Yeah, this is too funny. <laughs> I was I was young. Wait, are you for real? Yeah. Ooh. I didn't know this existed. I didn't know you got it. I did. <laughs> we have to drink this. Uh, oh God, it's so fat. Uh, oh! Uh, show them, show them. Oh gosh. Okay, I'm gonna go up here. But you. it is. It was very precious that Trey thought that the oven light brown things, because that makes sense. Oh God, can you see it? Can you see it in there? You might need to use. Well, let me. Uh... You might need to use Cock Josh's camera. You got a makeup guru hand it. Oh. You can, you can kind of, you can kind of see it. It's, oh, it's there like it the whole length. It, oh! Hot damn! <laughs> Is it a worm? Is it a worm? <laughs> Dead turtle walking home. Hey, Super Saiyan turtles here now. We got the two turtles. <laughs> oh, wait, what this? Yeah. <laughs> um, so this tequila is called Monte uh, Alban, and they always put a uh, grub worm, or a, a mealworm, I think. Yeah. In uh, wait, with agave worm, an agave, an agave worm, worm inside of the uh, tequila, uh, and you're you supposed to drink the tequila and then eat the worm. Eat the worm. The I remember when we we were. I was first introduced to this. They said that the the person behind the counter said that if you eat the worm, you will get like fucking busted. Uh, but I don't think you'll get busted. I think it's like just probably like cherries. You mm. know, like it just soaks up the mezcal or whatever. That's kind of like the legend behind like uh, hallucina hallucinations, ah, like, yeah. uh, absinthe. Yes, 
It's gotta get your protein somehow. Added protein. <laughs> you're all eating bug powder flour so you're not Wow, true. I saw it right before you pulled away. Wow. Oh no. Luna Rose freaking out. Leopard said, no thank you, respectfully. <laughs> <laughs> See, okay, I can respect that. I mean, just inhale it. <laughs> I mean, bug yes, powder it, is it, really good for you, though. It is edible. Like, worm, worms are just like bugs in general are actually a really good source of protein. Um, I have eaten, like, like bug uh, dishes, I guess you should probably say. Mm. Um... There's a certain, in when I went to go visit Laos, now it's been, you know, <laughs> almost 10 years ago, but... Oh, <laughs> hey, Ram Kim! <laughs> no worries, please no walk worries. home safely. Um, but I had, it's called a rocket bug. That's the, that's like the translation for it, is a Charger main, bug. It's not a charger bug. I would freak out if it was a charger bug. <laughs> but it tasted like... It was kind of cold, but I could tell they deep fried it, and it actually kind of tasted like potatoes. It tasted like cold french fries. Oh. So if I had it, like, it was crunchy. So if I had it straight out the fryer, I feel like I would enjoy it. I just can't see. They, like, took off the heads, or, like, I didn't look at it when I was eating it, basically. If it looks back at me, sometimes it freaks me out. That's the thing. Like, I don't want to I don't want to look at it. Yeah. But it tastes like a potato. I don't you know. You know what? We, we got to do this now. We have to make a cocktail with this. Okay. Is this a Resposado? I don't think this is that kind of stream. <laughs> oh, this is my mezcal. It's mezcal, yeah, yeah. All right, um, I'm going to make a mezcal uh, old-fashioned. All right, what's it called? Like, Oxford. <laughs> Everyone's like, ah! <laughs> Do you keep it in there for flavor? I've had crickets, and those were okay. So is somebody going to eat it? <laughs> I'm going to try this. We'll, we'll consider it. Consider this. I'm gonna try it. Are you gonna? Okay. Oh, it's like without the worm, just try. Yeah, the, I'm the so. Spirit? There's okay. a cocktail in here I've always wanted to try. Okay. And it's a tequila old or a mezcal old fashioned, I think. Okay. Um. I'm still working on my dirty martini, so. Where'd it go? This. I don't know how to pronounce that. Ozak. Ozakan. O. Ozakan. Old fashioned. I'll show you got the picture of it. I know Fisty knows how to pronounce this. There's a cheese that. that that is also that as well that's what it, it looks like but in it you use mezcal mezcal mm. and that's what this i do remember worm drink is enjoying mezcal uh papa bear uh who's in chat sometimes actually gave us our first taste of mezcal at a friend's giving a couple years ago and i remember really enjoying it however i don't know if it's because i was already a little toasty and i liked it or if i like legitimately liked it and i've only had like Patron tequila beforehand. I don't particularly like Patron. Mm. Red Crab says it sounds tasty. I mean, yeah, I think that would be really good. Mm -hmm. I just want to put the worm on there for garnish. For gar, <laughs> for garnish. It can't be bad though. It's, t I say it's tiny, but it looks fat as fuck. Yeah, that thing is giant. That thing's thangin'. Oh yes, turtle, but not. I have not updated our schedule. I used to play Sims on yeah. Tuesdays. Uh, but it's usually a variety of streams. So I need to go in and change that. Mm. Um, you you get a link stream once a week, and I usually play some sort of game or I cook. Um, and The Sims was on there for a little bit, but I fucked it up on our laptop, and now it doesn't. I have to like configure the the uh, the settings so that you can actually see it because I haven't played in a little while. <laughs> Can't be bad. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> you could spear the worm with the orange twist. That's what that's what Red Crab said. You know, actually. <laughs> I'm gonna do it. All right. I'm gonna make this like a pretty drink. I'm gonna try to make this okay, like. Sure. I'm gonna save this worm. Sure. You said sure. Okay. Thanks for the vote of confidence, babe. <laughs> Buddha Ruth respect. Said, respect. Yes, impale the worm. <laughs> impale the worm. Okay, I'm gonna finish my drink and start on that. Nice. <laughs> Oh, I'm nervous. Like by society. Hey, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome thank to the you. BLT bar. I'm Ling. I'm Trey. And we're the BLT bar. <laughs> this is Sunday Sipping, our, our Sunday bar show. Yep. Um, apparently, we're going to be making a mezcal old fashioned with a worm in it in just a minute. So. <laughs> okay. I'm glad. I'm so glad I stumbled in here. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're happy to have you here, Red Crab. Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, uh, okay. if you guys were to, would you guys, 
if you guys have not had bugs yet, would you try a bug? I would definitely try bugs. I actually had a... Uh... That should be interesting. <laughs> <laughs> would you try a bug? Yeah. Well, I, I mean, had, you're about to try one. But I like... had chocolate-covered ants before. Ants? Okay. Um, And I had, I want to say, che- sour cream flavored crickets. Crickets. Okay. I have seen... They used to be at the bookstore, actually. Yeah. And they're just crunchy. They're just kind of, mm-hmm. you know. <laughs> Leper said, no. The worm shall be penetrated. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you say it like that? <laughs> yeah, Lever! Yeah, Lever! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I love her. <laughs> uh, mm. I was running out of ways to say it, but that one was on your mind. <laughs> it's almost a silent disco, yes, <laughs> other than the creaking of our floors. <laughs> have you ever done a silent disco before? Have you guys ever done a silent disco before? I have seen a silent disco before. They're uh, hilarious. We saw it together, actually. Where? We were in, um... Oh, it was like a little uh, festival thingy in, in the square, right? Yeah, uh... What state were we in? This one. This is at home. Really? Yeah. It's it's in the square, and it's where... It's in the autumn no, time. No, where we went was somewhere different. We went oh. with, uh... It was actually Ramkip, Wildflower. It was for, uh... Ram Kip's birthday, I think. Oh, in North Carolina? Yeah, that's what it was. Okay. Yes, yes. We saw Silent Disco there. I had so the the town that I grew up in is very infamously known for a music festival called Bonnaroo, uh, and they had a silent disco there. So the very first time I witnessed it, I was like, "What the fuck is happening?" I didn't I didn't know it was a silent disco. I just thought everybody was like, you know, high off drugs or whatever, because that's what you know this festival is known for. So yo, these people are high, and I saw all the headphones that everybody had on, and I was like, "What oh. is this?" So I asked, and they were like, what is this solid disco? Do I listen to music all at the same time? And I was like, oh, okay. All right. I'm going to try this old-fashioned out. Uh, I haven't, but I'd be down to try the silent disco once. Uh, yeah, I, I I haven't tried it, but I would I would totally do it. I just dance anyway, so, I mean, it's easy. Uh, wish I can contribute wow. to... Oh, no, Dude, you're good. <laughs> you're good, Ram Kip. Oh, here. You're good, Ram Kip. Ram kip. Um. Oh, by the way, this is our beer tender Ram Kip that's in the chat. So he's the one. If you have any beer related questions, is Wahim. I'm so down for a silent disco. <laughs> we should do that. Actually, I think it'd be fun. So a Sunday sip in silent disco. Yes. We would just have to figure out how to to cast music to more than two people at the same time, which I feel like Spotify might do, but I don't know. Okay. I'm just gonna tell you to tell me more without me playing inside the Oh, okay, mm-hmm. gotcha. I will say, I do always feel like uh, Leopard loves to dance with us whenever we do start dancing because their emotes are the best. Dude, that, They're the animated emotes. So <laughs> the one yesterday when I was singing, uh, She'll Be Coming Around the Mountain, it was that little frog I was like throwing his ass. <laughs> it's my favorite. It's my favorite. Tequila Resposado. Is a hat a special hat? Uh, no. It is just a... Well, I mean, we can make it a special hat. It depends. Oh, wait, are you talking about Trey's hat? Or are you talking about a put-on hat? Because put-on hat is a is a uh, channel point rewards. Is the hat a, like a special hat? If no, it's talk- just like a really... Or, yeah, I don't know what they're talking about. Yeah, so if we're talking Trey's hat, go ahead and explain. This is the yarn hat. We... Actually, last week, our wonderful friend Iria gifted this to Trey. Uh, gonna hop off since phone's getting low on battery. Alrighty, thank you so much, Kat, for joining us. Here's a little finger heart. Bam. Bam. A flying kiss for you. <sighs> and hydrate. I don't have any water. Damn it. Okay, cool. Here's some... Oh, is there sparkling water? Yeah, right here. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I hope that for you, too. <laughs> I remember when we were open, like, 10 to 10, and, dude, the last two hours always drug on like monday tuesday sunday monday tuesdays okay so i'm gonna do 
One and a half ounces of tequila. Resposado. Are you making, what are you making? Oh, wait, that's an Anejo. Um, yeah, old fashioned. But you need just, a Reposado? Yeah. We don't have one. I thought we did. Oh, this is a good one too. It, yeah, we do, it's right here. Where? Oh, oh, okay. All right, extra hydrate. Thank you so much. Cheers. One and a half ounces, you said? Yes. Oh, hydrate. Mm-hmm. And you guys, make sure to take a sip of uh, water as well. Look at my hand. Again, hydro homies are the best homies. <laughs> look at my hand. You say, look at my hand? Like, are you okay? <laughs> yeah, I am. You said, look at my hand. <laughs> it's wiggling. I know. We all can see. <laughs> it's wiggling. It's Love wiggling it. like we couldn't see it. Love it's laughing. Look at my hand. It's wiggling. <laughs> oh, the, the way the fucking worm. Dude, it came out like a poop. Ew! Oh god, wait, this smells weird. Wait, what is this? What? Um, it smells like formaldehyde. Damn, it do be smelling like formaldehyde. I'm gonna drink it. Uh, pre-closing stuff. I'm gonna drink it. Alrighty, Ramkip, thank you so much for stopping by. We hope that work goes shit. by uh, fast I'm for you. We hope you have a wonderful shit. night. See ya. I'm gonna drink it. Uh, Brew, come here. Yeah. I'm gonna drink it. Red crab, blue crab has. Yeah. I'm gonna drink this shit. This is Brew, everybody. I'm gonna drink this shit. Everybody, she had to Brew. Here we go now. Yeah. Gonna drink the shit. It does smell like formaldehyde. Agave syrup. Wait, the music stopped. Oh, what do we need to like shine bright like a diamond? Oh god, he looks like a cryptid. Oh, just just uh just restart this, please. There you go. Oops. Here, bro. There we go. Uh. There we go. Where's what the agave cutie syrup? Boy? Oh, there it is. Aren't you a cutie boy? <laughs> I like how you say boy. Boy. You a cutie boy? Aren't you a good boy? Hello, Ruby. Everybody says hi. Oh, hold on. Let me. Add some agave syrup and two dashes of chocolate bitters. Can you hand me the Aztec chocolate bitters? Yes. Here you go. Everybody says you're cute. One, it wasn't two. just wiggling, though. It was very smooth. Thank you, Luna Roo. <laughs> uh. When can I give Brew a treat? <laughs> Lepra said, I hope this drink is good. You know what, Brew, since you've been good, you're gonna get a free treat, okay? Does that sound good? Brew's a very, like, chill dog. <laughs> He's either really chill or has no chill. Like, there's yeah. no in-between. Can I kiss? Oh. He's just hot. He stayed up late last night, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Can I have a kiss? Or can you kiss? Is that okay? Okay, we'll give him a free treat since oh. he's been... <laughs> All right. Is that worms in there? No, the oh. worm is not in there yet. All right. Oh, shit, I need to get the garnishes ready. Um, I need a... What do you need? Orange. That's in there. Do we have the um citrus peeler up here? Um... That's okay, I was using that. Uh, can we use Cock Josh's camera real quick? Yeah. All right. Turtle but not, you get a free redeem, excuse me, redeem brew a drink, uh, a drink, redeem brew a treat. Ready? No, no! Wow. I hate that. <laughs> it's sleepy in there, apparently. It's a formaldehyde. <laughs> <laughs> Ready for a treat? Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead. Oh, can you get the camera open? Oh shit, sorry. Okay, come here. Sit. Spin. Oh, spin. Okay, got it. Good boy. That's for you. Look at him go. Is it good, Brew? Is it good? It looks like he's enjoying it. Oh. <laughs> okay. Tree is on the house. Absolutely, turtle, but not. 
I need a Rocks glass. A BLT <laughs> bar branded glass. Absolutely. Are you finished with these? Do, 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 do. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the ice cube in there actually. I was gonna Okay. I should have just built it in the glass when yeah, I was Yeah, you probably should have just made it. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> so I'm pour that on top. It's very pretty, I will say that. It is a really pretty color. I'm gonna express a little bit of orange on top of there. Um, I'm gonna get a bourbon cherry. As you can tell, I'm trying to mask the flavor of this, uh, this worm. Are you really about to eat the worm, is what Leopard said? Yeah. Just realized, didn't you stream yesterday? And I don't think that, yeah, it was, yesterday absolutely was not a Tuesday. Well, good the, oh. the schedule is not exactly correct. However, if you type an exclamation point Discord, you feel free to join our Discord. That's when I'll give updates on when I'm streaming. Because I try to shoot for Tuesdays, but usually you'll just get me sometime during the week. <laughs> Leopard likes the color. Yeah, well, I think it's very pretty. We're gonna do a little. Where are you putting the garnish like that? And then we're gonna grab this. this worm. Where are you putting the worm? Come here, wormy. Are you soft or crunchy? I'm sure you're soft. Okay. Show them, show them, show them. Right, what if I started? <laughs> Here's the. I'm actually gonna sit here and show them. Okay, this is trash. Good go. There's the worm. I guess I'm about to take a mezcal shot, but... You're like shaking! I'm shaking because like, I'm, I'm holding the end of the spoon and it's a very long spoon. Oh, okay. Look at it do its thing. It, it, uh... It's the Alaskan bullworm, guys. <laughs> Alright. I need more impale synonyms for the word. <laughs> Uh, oh my, I hope this drink is good. <laughs> okay, first, I'm just gonna, well, here. Should you stab it? I, how do I stab this? Just pick it up and stab it. Yeah, just pick it up. It's no different than, than like a cherry, right? It's like a, it's like a fruit. It's a fruit. It's a fruit. <laughs> it's a fruit. It. <laughs> it's impaled on there. It's, it's impaled, yeah. It looks like it's riding like a spaceship. All right, this is the. I wait, don't know how to wait, we need work. a picture. Oh, yeah, you're right. Is it Oaxcan? Oax. I'm gonna say Oaxcan for now. If Should we try this by itself first? Yeah, let's try the let's try the mezcal on its own. Oh, it smells so weird. It smells strange. I will say, I don't like. I don't know if I like the way it smells. I bet it's not as bad as it smells though. It kind of. Hmm. I'll let you go for it. <sighs> Okay, I want a picture of the worm. Okay. What's it smell like? It smells like... <laughs> nope, the facial expression! <laughs> oh, it smells like formaldehyde meets... Like... It's a fruit! If I just... Uh... Oaxaca. Thank you. Thank Oaxaca. you so much. Okay. I was like, I know I'm not pronouncing it correctly. Oh, it's like Oaxaca cheese. That's a cheese. Yeah, that's the cheese that I was thinking of. Okay. Thank you, Red Crab. <laughs> so like... it said Oaxacan old fashioned. Yes. Got it. Also, it's mostly like formaldehyde meets like, right. like paint thinner a little bit. Yeah, this smells like a, like a hardware store. This smells vintage. Wow. That's delicious. Oh. Try it. By itself, it's not good. Ew. Oh, God. Yeah, that, that mezcal by itself is terrible. In here, <laughs> try that. <laughs> oh, and then the aftertaste is so much better. Oh. Oh, shit. Mmm. Ooh, okay. See the... All right. Now wait for the aftertaste. So it's got a little bit of sweetness up in the front, but it's 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 a very mellow sweet. It's you know how like corn very rounded and mellow. You know how corn is sweet. It's kind of like corn. It's yeah. Like fresh corn sweetness. 
it kind of settles a little bit. It still has that like aged vintage. You know how like you know the smell of old leather, like worn leather. That's kind of what it's giving me. That's really good. Stab Jeff. Help me. <laughs> okay. All right. Now it's time for the. Are you gonna eat this with me? Uh, yeah. I guess we should probably cut it in half, huh? Do you want to? I I I ain't gonna let you do this by yourself. All right. We're in this together, bro. You grab a knife. I made that face. <laughs> My Purina plant. <laughs> Damn red crab. The drink looks good. I would try it. Please don't let this squirt. <laughs> Why'd you flinch? I thought it was gonna squirt. All right, cut it in half. Should we chew it? Yeah, we should chew it. Ah! All right, we'll take a sip, then throw it in, chew and drink. Oh. This, we do this for your entertainment. Are you not entertained? You are my heroes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, give me a little bit of like. Here, me... let me get you a skewer so we can kind of pop it in. I was just gonna pick it up. Oh no, I have a skewer right here. Okay. Wait, you? Okay. Oh no, I think I got the head or the butt. I don't. I can't tell. It's dark. I have the dark side. It's both. Dark side oh, okay, here we go. Wait, what are we doing? We're gonna take a sip, throw it in, chew and drink. Take a sip, throw it in. And just so you guys know, it's real. That's my half of the worm. Here's mine. I You can't see it. And this is her half of the worm. Your side is like light colored, mine is dark. Damn. Oh, mine has- Don't hair. look! It has hair! Don't look, don't look! Mine don't look at it! Don't look at it! feelers! Don't look at it! Okay. All right. I'm gonna take my sip and I'm gonna drink it and you guys take yours. Here we go. Dink it. <laughs> dink it, sink it, and drink it. Uh, okay. Alright, we're taking a sip and take, chewing, right? Yep. Mine wasn't too bad. I breathed and it went in my, in my throat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. If you, if I just imagined a popping boba, it's not too bad. Mine had feelers and it stuck to my taste buds. Oh. <laughs> you okay. It literally felt like something did this to my tongue, like like hooked on. Oh God. So when I was trying to swallow, it was just like. Oh. Oh. <laughs> you chose this life. I stay here with you. I'm just gonna give that to you. <laughs> okay. Apparently, we're supposed to hallucinate or something now, right? Damn. That was the most casual way to say that. Okay. Apparently, we're supposed to hallucinate now, right? <laughs> That's how it works. Which means it, it it might be pretty intense later, but I think it'd be okay. Did you taste it? It. It didn't have a, the the drink overpower the taste. It was a texture. I bit down on mine and immediately that came through. Oh, uh, it's probably been sitting in there for a hot ass minute. So, by itself, I'm gonna try this again. It's not good by itself, guys. This drink is oh, not. It, it smells like it, shoe leather. It's it yeah. It doesn't smell good. It doesn't taste good. And the drink is good though. Screen, Screen caps have been uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> no. That wasn't too bad. The face. <laughs> oh, was... Would you do it again? Uh, yeah, I would. I would. But... Probably, I would probably. I wish I took the other side because mine had feelers. Yeah. The next time I do it, I would take the. We we need to we need to bisect it next time. That it's is bad. Horrible. That's bisect. horrid. I don't like it. You ate an abundance. I bet that one was seventy percent alcohol. Oh. Gross. <laughs> Wow, you would? Okay. Somebody would have to buy this drink for me. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to go out of my way, but if they're like, hey, happy birthday, hee hee ha ha, I, I would, you know, I'm not going to waste it because I would drink One it. One of your hairs is on my leg. I'm sorry. I can feel it. <laughs> or is it the, the worm? <laughs> the 
<laughs> you're making my human, uh, We're glad we can, Red Crab. Ah. <laughs> oh. I think we should do one more drink. One more? Yes. All right, this time you're going to make this one. Yes. I do want to try that gin fizz. So mm-hmm. if we can find the recipe for that, because mm-hmm. I'm really curious about it. <laughs> oh, no, the cookie drink. Because we had two people request cookie. We did our drink for leopard already. So Oh, cookie, okay. You have to help me create this, though. So, of course, Thank you, my Red first Crab. thought would be chocolate. But I'm thinking, so I just, I recently made some brown butter bourbon. Um, so I'm thinking for cookies, need some brown butter. Oh, okay, yeah, that's... So let's go ahead and grab that brown butter bourbon. Thank you for redeeming the hydrate. Um, the sparkling water definitely helps. <laughs> Very glad I decided to join. <laughs> We're happy you joined today, turtle but not. <laughs> okay so we're thinking a brown butter bourbon uh is that the one it should be i think yeah i can mm. see it i don't think so i think it's actually this one wait this one has stuff in it wait just open up and smell it is this one is this just sediment then yeah yeah remember that's the beer barrel aged one. Oh. well that one is too that yeah but that, i like filtered this one oh okay okay you want to smell it just to make sure Oh, yeah, that one's a brown butter. Brown oh, man, butter. So much. Butter. Look at So, him. brown He's butter so infused cute. bourbon. He's so cute. You can mouth him like a basketball. You want fun over there? Yeah. You can mouth him like a basketball. He's so <laughs> round. Look at him. All right, so let's do... Um, We do need some... I feel like... I found it. it. Did oh. I get it? I got it. Uh-huh. It's not the worm. <laughs> I want to use. I want to use that Mozart chocolate. Mozart chocolate. <clears throat> hmm. Oh. Um. Ah, oh, dang it, turtle. But not. <laughs> you think? Um. Maybe it's, a little bit of like for like a peanut or like a nutty taste. Maybe like a like a what's it called? The almond liqueur. Uh, why am I blanking on the name? Brulee. No, that's pecan liqueur. Uh, like a nut liqueur. Yeah. Amaretto. Amaretto. God, I couldn't get almond? it out. I just want to see what most of these do. <laughs> <laughs> well, feel free to ask your. Uh, Yes, thank you, Wallflower. <laughs> Ask your fellow uh, sippers in the chat because some people have really accrued some, um, <laughs> some a lot of points. Some points. Uh, okay, so yeah, now I have this hat on for ten minutes. Um, what was I doing? Oh, a brandy Alexander. But I feel like we could we could do we can do this instead of brandy. Okay. A whiskey Alexander. So you're replacing the brandy with whiskey. Thank you, Leopard! Burp, 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 burp. <laughs> Turtle said, come on, man. Okay, No! No! Oh, uh, lyrics! No, please. Damn it! No. Alright, I'll put a different one on. All right, we got a Sonic hat tonight. Bum, 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 I don't know how to make a brandy I'm always Alexander. a fan of pins. <laughs> Here, let me help you out. Oh, God, no, a turtle. A turtle, but not. You better just make me walk back and forth. <laughs> brandy. Ice! Why don't you just take all the hats over here and put them underneath the, uh... You're right. <laughs> Lyric said, you want to do this, Leopard? <laughs> no, I'm not, Wildflower. I'm really not. No. You were just singing Rihanna. Okay, whatever. Okay. Okay, so we have Cognac. Mm. Which we're going to sub with this. Okay. Okay. Put Heavy on a cream. Hat. Take off a hat. Creme de cacao. Do we have that? Oh, duh. Angostura bitters hat. and orange bitters. 
Damn, this is a battle going on. <laughs> Put on the hat. Okay, I got two hats. This hat I'm getting. <laughs> hat I'm getting. <laughs> if Dixie were here, <laughs> she's our other moderator and she loves this. <laughs> Quick, mispronounce something in French to summon Frankel. Uh, omelette du fromage. From oh, fromage. Stop. From mage. Um, omelette. Omelette, omelette du fromage. From mage. All right, lovers coming in clutch. Hey, lovers coming in clutch. I feel like this is like Thank an you. anime battle where they're like, this he's a, a leopard has a sword that's just take off hat, and uh, turtle <laughs> has, has a. a I think it's a lep or it's larynx. Larynx. And wildflower putting on the hat. <laughs> when they crowd control making BLT. Yeah, it was. J. Oh my god. So I gotta tell that story. So there was one, uh, st <laughs> there was a stream we had where we were making BLTs. And we made it to where you can use points to add or subtract things from the BLT. Oh, wait, I need this. And it was hilarious because there is, and <laughs> we had neighbors across the street who were wait because we couldn't eat that many BLTs. Yes. So whatever BLT we would make, we would deliver across the street. There was a BLT where people kept saying subtract bacon, and it was just. Bread and lettuce. <laughs> <laughs> there was one that was just bacon. It was just bacon. Then there was like, there was one weird one that was just like no bread, lettuce, bacon. It was Larix's very first stream in here, and he was extra confused because we said that BLT didn't stand for BLTs, but we were making, making BLT BLTs. Sandwiches. <laughs> <laughs> so when I would bring people there, and the thing is, they had to eat whatever we gave them. <laughs> So when I brought their BLTs, they were like, all right, what did I get? And I'm like, bro, you got lettuce and bread. And like, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, Have that, fun! That shit was so funny. Okay. We're going to do another one of those. Yes, we do. We're going to do an Angus story. Okay, so... <laughs> um, the look on his face when he saw a BLT with no bacon or tomato. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was great. So I think we made one with oh. our eyes closed or something. Yeah. Because the, like the bacon was sticking out of the. the they were not like, pretty. <laughs> it was like the bread was over here and the lettuce was like hanging <laughs> off the plate and I had to deliver it as is. Yep. Orange. They had a watch party and everything. That was fun. Yeah, we should we should do another. We'll do another uh, making a BLT night? like actual sandwich night. And you guys can redeem a couple points. Uh, watch my streams and like gather them up, and then you can use add bacon. <laughs> As I forget to take off the reward points the week after we did it, make it. That should be like a uh, annual stream on the anniversary of the uh, Sunday. Oh uh, yeah, so. bacon, lettuce, and tray. Bacon, <laughs> lettuce, and tray. <laughs> yes, we'll let you guys know it on the Discord. That sounds like the perfect Sammy to me. Hey, yeah, it does. Ooh. <laughs> hey, we'll yeah, uh, yeah. we'll announce things on the Discord. So we'll probably do a BLT night pretty soon, actually. Okay. Okay, orange bitters Speaking of bills, and Gastura bitters. I'm kind of hungry. I'm kind of hungry. Luna Roo just, oh, thank you for the subscription, Oh my god, Luna thank Roo. you so much, Luna Roo. She subscribed for 11 months. 11 months? It's almost a year? Thank we'll you, give you so much. Thank you, Luna Roo. Ooh. So something that is coming around the corner. So around Christmas, we always do uh, the BLT bar giveaway. But there's something I've been Holiday kind of box giveaway. Yeah, the holiday box giveaway. Um, I'm, I kind of have a few ideas for like the holiday season, especially when it comes to like Halloween, Thanksgiving, and Christmas. Um, so keep a lookout on the discord. If you're not a part of the discord, what the hell are you doing? Type in exclamation point discard. Wait, is it already there? Yeah, uh, it's right yes. there. Thank you, Leopard. Join the discord and, um, you know, chat with us on there personally, uh, hang out with the other sippers and stuff like that. It's a little quiet right now, yeah. uh, just because we've been kind of busy. So feel free to just share memes. Uh, we have a wedding around the corner. Um, yes. And that has been consuming. Bro, there was a freaking, um, mosquito in here. What the fuck? <laughs> It just uh, assaulted my wrist. Don't scratch it. Um, we have a wedding that we are playing, and we are around, I think, 50 days as of today. 49. 49 days as of today. <laughs> so yeah. we've been very busy with that. Yeah. And then after that, you know, we'll go full force with the, the stream again. Um, other things in our life have, have taken a backseat just due to the wedding yes. being around the corner. Yeah. So, yeah. That is exciting. Y'all literally ate a worm. You have my support. Can I try this drink uh, y'all are making when I come next? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Revenge for the worm. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, 
So I need a coop. Hmm. So I know when we end stream, we usually have uh, Cock Josh uh, play us out. Mm-hmm. Should we let Chicken Josh say something? He's never really said what anything yet. Thank you so much for joining the Discord. Where is the... Where is the... What you looking for? The coop. Like the... Oh, there it is. I see it. Look at, look at the little man's down here. He's here. Coop. He's down here. Brew was like... He's like laid out down Dead to the wall. Right <laughs> Damn, he got camera shy. Well, Bill, the song, y'all. Okay. <laughs> okay, I do need a shaker for this. Okay, oh, yeah. shaker. You want a cobbler or a Boston shaker? Let's do a. Let's do a Boston. No, let's do a cobbler because I have to double strain it. So okay, that'll be easier. Double strain is fine. I mean, you can double strain with a. Yeah, Boston. I was gonna say, but like for me, it'd be easier to oh. do this. Way. Can you chill this? Can I chill this? Yeah, just stick it in the fridge. In the fridge. Okie dokie. Next game, Just Dance. I would totally play Just Dance on stream, Ooh, actually. That'd be so much fun. That'd be hilarious. <laughs> if you guys want to see a Just Dance stream, I'm about it. Do we have... Do we have just dance? Oh, wait, we can just get on uh, Switch, right? Yeah. Okay, let me add everything and then add the ice. So, we are going to need one and a half ounces of <laughs> cognac, which we are going to substitute for brown butter infused bourbon yes how i made this i just really i just browned some butter on the stove uh poured the whiskey into a pretty big container uh poured the butter on top of that and let it marinate for like marinate for a few hours um then put that inside of the freezer let all the butter solidify and then uh cheesecloth ah it. shit what what happened i had too much oh and then i cheesecloth strained it um, and it has like a more nutty kind of, uh, how do I describe this? Nuttery, nutty, smooth, and, uh... It definitely smooths out the bourbon. Yeah, th those those high spiky notes kind of come down. It it feels buttery. Yeah. Which is tasty. Um, okay, so one and a half ounces of uh, brown butter bourbon. I need one ounce of heavy cream, which should be in there. Heavy cream? An ounce of creme de cacao, which we're using in Mozart. What the, uh, for a lot of drinks. So the okay. BLT Bar musical is we have to, I think for five minutes, we have to sing. Sing everything that we do. Yeah. <laughs> um.
the cookie Alexander. <coughs> oh gosh. Look, grab that brown butter bourbon. Boom. Is everything okay with you? Is this messy? Is this too messy in the back? Uh, I kind of want a different background. Um, actually, it's kind of blurred in the background, so maybe we're good. Here, let me turn it this way. Okay. Hey, and then you go this way. Hey! Yeah, that way you get the bar in the back. Do you want it on us this? Sure. How's that? Perfect. Yeah! Let's showcase that a little bit. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, look at that layering. Oh, is it actually? Yay! That's what I was going for. Okay. Let's go. Let us try. The drinks have been blessed by the worm. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, worm. All right, let's try this out. Do you want to do the honors? I actually really like Brandy Alexander's just in general. We did an episode that was just um, classic cocktails and Al My Feelings and Lyrics both helped out with that. This was one of my favorites. Don't say anything just about it yet. Pretty good, right? That's a fucking cookie. That did, that did pretty good. I actually will say, I think I think I would swap out the Angostura bitters with maybe the chocolate tamarind bitters to add a little bit more chocolate because yeah. I can I can very distinctly taste the Angostura. Angostura. Yeah. Like I could taste it. Um, I would agree with that. I think maybe if you because we we were prompted with did you say cookie. chocolate tamarind or Aztec chocolate? Maybe Aztec chocolate. I think Aztec chocolate would be, would be better. But because you were prompted with Cookie Alexander, I was already kind of thinking about it. That is... I think this is the best... There's heavy whipping cream in that. Are you going to be okay? I'm, that's my okay. last sip. I think that's the best cocktail, like, made-up cocktail you've made. Well, thank you. I basically just said that one thing, but, like, that brown butter is really shining in it, I think. Yes, yeah, it kind of gave it, like, a nutty taste. Mm -hmm. All right. This is really good. All right, thank you guys for the, the suggestion. Chocky so garnish. we have made a dirty martini, a uh, chocolate uh, uh, Manhattan. Yeah, that's right. A Oaxacan old fashioned, and a chocolate chip cookie, uh, Brandy Alexander. Yes, a cookie Alexander. Cookie Alexander. I see. <laughs> Man, that is really good. I wish I could have more of it. I can't, Thank you. but. Um, yeah, because we might be able to use an egg white instead, so you can get that, like, foam on top. Here, let me show you guys. Yeah, but make, make sure you show them that. It looks really good. Okay, so this is, this is what we got going on. So you can see where it actually separates from the head uh, of the of cream is on top, and then the rest of the bottom. It's even kind of cookie colored. And then show them the top, too. Man, that was really good. Bye-bye! They all seem like great drinks, yeah. The only thing that was sucky was the mezcal on its own. Yeah, that mezcal was awful. That, that in shit this drink, it it, it tastes so good. In the drink, it's tasty, yes, but in the by itself, by itself it's awful. Which goes to show the power of teamwork, I guess. <laughs> all right, guys. Well, we actually went. No, we perfect. One forty-five. Mm -hmm. Guys, we really appreciate you guys coming along this ride and. Uh, you know coming back to sunny sipping yeah. for all of you that are new we really appreciate uh, you coming and watching us and we hope you enjoy your time with us um i don't think we have any uh, oh uh we will not be doing, doing sunny sipping next week because we were going to be out of town on yes. our uh, bachelor slash bachelorette trip mm -hmm. well we might be able to uh depending on how how much energy level we have we might be able to either do sunday sipping on a different day mm -hmm. or it just might be rescheduled so uh, like we said, type in exclamation point Discord to join us in our Discord. That's where we do post our stream updates. You will see me this week on Tuesday, properly on Tuesday. Yeah. I don't know if you'll see my face or if you'll see the VTuber. We'll, we'll see. Uh, but you will see me, and we're going to be playing some more Breath of the Wild because I don't know where the, the urge to play it came yeah, from. But it know. did. But we're playing Breath of the Wild. <laughs> um, Good night and be well, you too. Thank you so much, Rick. Thank you. 
Um, do you have any other announcements? Uh, uh, we're not doing Sunday Sippin' next yep. week. Uh, or maybe. It depends on... Yeah, Sunday Sippin' is will definitely TBA. be rescheduled if we did. Yes. And then I'm actually streaming on Tuesday. As long as everything goes well that day as well. But other than that... Yeah, thank you guys so much. We really appreciate everybody new and old and everybody in between. Uh, please take care of yourselves. Please make sure to take care of the, your loved ones around you as well. Drink a lot of water. Be a hydro homie. Be a hydro and homie. Yeah, if you got any memes, post them in the Discord. We like memes, so. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Any other questions at all? Uh, I, don't think we're... I think we're good. Let's see. Hold up. Before. Ah, I see. You want to make sure. So, wait, oh, hold on. It looks like it might be Oolong's birthday. Is it Oolong's birthday? I think it's Oolong's birthday today. A birthday celebration is what she said. Okay, so, all right. If everybody wants to hold on and hang on to your seats real quick, we are actually, if you want to go ahead and click that. Yeah. Uh, we are going to go and say hello to our wonderful friend Oolong Crossing, who does a weekly uh, Gong Fu tea stream. So she drinks tea on stream um, and like has snacks and stuff. And she's like the, the most wholesome person she's in the entire so world. She's so cute. Her name is Gail. And she, she's... It looks like it's her birthday uh, today. So let's go send her some BLT birthday loves. Um, but yeah. So we're gonna do our little outro. Uh, once that's complete, make sure you stay, I'll, uh, stay and wish um, Oolong a happy uh, birthday. Oolong a happy birthday. Um, or I hope it's her birthday. It says a birthday celebration, so I'm assuming. Wish whoever's birthday it is a happy yeah. birthday. Uh, <laughs> make sure you are nice and chat. We yes. are safe sippers. We are. Yes, we're safe sippers. Yes. We trust y'all. <laughs> so y'all have a good night. We'll see you over at Oolongs. See you guys. Bye.